Hello and welcome to another Shadowverse Evolve unboxing. Today with that number seven, uh, Verdant, Verdant Steel, in Japanese. And yeah, recently Shadowverse Evolve was kinda, kinda nice to me. Uh, so far I did pull two leader cards. Uh, one from set number five, yeah, five. One from set number four, one of the Code GS ones on a, in a live stream, that was awesome. And I did pull one UR in my, in another live stream. So yeah, not that bad that for, I, I don't, or like besides set number four, I haven't opened so much. And yeah, for the future, I, I have to look, maybe I will try to get, to get one box from a new set, but I really cannot, uh, cannot tell at the moment if I will be able to to afford it because I still need to save some money for for a trip to Japan and for V Cross of course. But yeah, let's see into this box and yeah I did got two boxes from the ooh from the next release from set number eight. At the moment I haven't bought into set number nine. There's like already depending when I upload this video, it could be that there's already like set number 10 feels like there is a new set every two or three months maybe it's probably three months but yeah <laughs> they they have a schedule and it's yeah getting a lot of releases what is with this this looks so derpy what's like with this warm oh that's that's really weird and funny and then we have a mate. Oh, we get the fury. Uh, the the daddy one. Mm. Daddy lion. Master of the, the furies. Uh, okay, another GR. There are like some cool leaders in this set too. And of course, pulling a UR would be awesome as always. Uh, there are like some brighter colored URs. Like my UR I pulled from set number five is really, really dark. That's fat kitty. Is it like really the furry set? Have I missed something? Have they targeted a special audience? Oh, and they have dinosaurs, so I'm in. Pretty cool. And then we have like the regular version of the of this like special holofoil and looks like there is this effect or this dot looks like dirt but it's not dirt but it looks very weird like when I tilt the card it looks like a mistake but it's supposed to be there I guess and we get a tree I'm seeing like a big tree like this always reminds me of uh, Oh, like the Night Elf tree in World of Warcraft. Was it Yggdrasil? I think this was the name. Oh, we got another uh, big chunky cat and another algae. This time it's not the furry daddy, this time it's the vampire daddy. Interesting. And another big cat. Ooh, another algae. I don't remember if this was the set they they basically introduced a guaranteed SL or was it the set before? Actually, don't remember. I think they have reduced like the number of packs in the displays, of course, and uh, the guaranteed SL. But when they did this, another oh, this is the spell. Another lion. Yeah, I, I haven't checked like all of the cards. I, I still want to get like surprised by some of the artworks. Sometimes I do uh, do a look into the card gallery before an unboxings, or maybe yeah, in some videos I do this like on camera. But for this one, I wanted to go blind into it. And what is with him? Oh, this is so weird. And it's like the same art style, like the, the big fish and the worm. And we get another 
special foiling uh, hawk looking artifact creature. Oh man, how many how many fairy tokens do you need? Like it feels like there is in every in every release the same fairy token, but maybe it's just a very important token you use like in every second deck. Okay. Oh a bunny. Bunny girl with like multiple uh clocks. Flavor flave bunny. Another spell and a GR. We also already pulled. So so far we have three. So it's either like one more LG and one SL. Or maybe we get like six hits. Oh, this is like really, man. The Fury set. It will make a nice title for YouTube. And dinosaurs, furry and dinosaurs. Like, I'm happy about the dinosaurs. Dinosaurs are always cool. Maybe there's like a Spinosaurus, the best, the best dinosaur. This one looks cool too. Oh, looks more like a Allosaurus or like a raptor, like a very big raptor. Uh, uh, okay, this could fit into my Egypt collection, maybe. I like the sword, like the, the sword is very much looking like Egypt or Persian style. Maybe more Persian because of the camels. Like back in ancient Egypt, I, I don't think they had like camels so early. I think they came later. Oh, we have another hit in this bag. We have another leader. Oh my God. This is the most expensive card from the set. What is with my Shadowverse lock? What the? So now I'm not sure how I should like uh, put a name onto this unboxing for the juicy YouTube clicks like furry unboxing or like I pulled the most expensive card. What the? This looks so cool. Oh, and I hope it's not damaged. Like sometimes uh, it's the last card in the pack and this this is a white bag and yeah, there's like something on the card. You should see it. And yeah, my, my first leader pole had some damage on the edges. Because it's a thicker cardstock. It's a lot thicker than the regular cards. It's... Uh, oh my god, what is her name? I don't know her. Fuorite? Fuorite? What was... Forte? Yeah, Fort, okay. Very cool artwork. Oh, that's... Yeah, maybe this is like a sign. When, I, when I'm when i like thinking about, ah, oh, man, I, I have to quit buying Shadowverse because I don't have the money. And then now it's Shadowverse is throwing all of the hits into my face and it's like, no. You don't stop buying Shadowverse because here are like the nice juicy hits for you and the big cat daddies. That's what you want. <laughs> and I'm probably like, oh, sure, yeah. Call me in. Oh, that's cool. But uh, yeah, it basically, oh, this is something interesting. Like the, the leader card is the SL pull, like there is the leader card, but no. Oh, I thought there should be like another SL hit. I don't think I've skipped it. Shouldn't have skipped it, right? But yeah, they they have only now three, only four hits per box. I'm confused. I thought that there would be like one more general hit, but it could be that the leader card counts for a hit 
before the hit. It's not an additional hit. But yeah, thank you for watching. This was like very unexpected. And let's end the video with a force of will pack. And yeah, maybe we will. Of course, I have set number eight, as I said, but I. Uh, maybe I will get like the, the next releases too, depending on. Uh, yeah, if I have the money. <laughs> but yeah, thank you for watching. And for more unboxings, please check out my channel. And see you in my next unboxing. Bye.